What's up agents and welcome back to another division video. Today I'm going to show you how to become invincible and I am not joking, invincible in the division 2. Special shout out to Kong and to Kamikaze Von Doom. I will link their channels down below. That is where this information has come from. And before I get started, be sure to hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up and hit the bell so you are notified when I upload more Division videos. Even better, come on over to Twitch. I could be streaming live right now. And if you need a community Discord, there has never been a better time to join. You'll find the link down below in the description. And with all that said, let's get started. So here I am. I am at District Union Arena. And I have selected Legendary. And what I'm going to do, I am just going to run into here now. Get the attention of some of these ads like this. Pop out my shield. I'm just going to go in and stand here. And what you'll notice is, although, yep, grenades are a pain. And you can probably change it up, use demo or, or something like that. But you'll notice that I am not dying. And you can have as many people in your group as you want for this. Uh, the damage is the same. I've tested it with two, three, and four people. And you just don't die. So I'm pretty sure this is not working as intended. It's absolutely insane. Something is going very wrong here. But do be warned, if you set this build up, it might not work for you. Uh, that is a problem I had at the beginning. And what was really, really strange about it, I had to travel to the dark zone, go into the dark zone, come out, travel straight back, and all of a sudden, it just starts to work. Because my shield was just getting absolutely destroyed previously, and then I would just die. Uh, so, which way around is working the right way around? I don't know. Like, I felt like I died really easily uh, on a tank build, and I really feel like you shouldn't. But this way around feels way too tanky, and obviously that you know this shouldn't exist in the game you, you literally cannot die like eventually you get some bleed damage from the, the nades and stuff and eventually you die but i even went afk in the live stream when we were doing this and i came back and i was still alive i'll try and get to the spot now where i went afk you can kind of just get yourself in here wedge yourself in here and because you, you can get pushed out of it you know if the grenade lands awkward but generally look hands free you can just kind of stay here swap weapons around and and survive now i don't really feel like this has much purpose i mean if you want to run a tank a healer and two dps in legendary i mean i guess it's going to work this person can stand up front take all the flak and and not die but damage output for this is terrible like it is absolutely terrible i couldn't i couldn't kill things fast it would have taken me an absolute week and a half to, to finish the legendary we probably could buff it up a little bit with some reds uh, and it would probably still work and probably do a really, really good job still. Uh, and I might check that out and throw a build together and, and see how we get on. But as far as it being sensible to run, I, you know, I don't really feel like it, it is. So all I'll do is why I'm being absolutely smashed by all these NPCs. Uh, I'll take my shield off just to show you, you know, I can survive without the shield as well. You know, once everything's propped, you can see at the bottom the gear set buff is propped. And you can also see that the catharsis is procking constantly. Hi mate, you're alright. Uh, this guy wants to join me. We just have a dance for him. And uh, yeah, you can kind of dance away and, and not die even without your shield. And what's surprising is this time I've not even taken any bleed damage yet either. So my health is absolutely fine. But if you want to be a bit more safer, you just put the shield out. So let's have a look at the build. Here it is. Well, actually I can't, so I might die here. But here we go. We've got the Catharsis. We have got four piece Bulwark. We've got the Empress named item Knees. And what you'll notice is on all of these, we've got uh, incoming repairs, armor regen, and incoming repairs. But honestly, I've had agents put this together with lesser stats, and it really doesn't matter. You can run this with stats that are pretty mediocre from the crafting bench and still get the same result. Armor regen, incoming repairs. If I get back in again. You can see here on the chest piece, armor, armor regen, incoming repairs, gloves, armor, armor regen. 
medical assistance. We have got the holster, armor, armor, regen, and we have got Emperor's Guard, knee pads, armor, regen, and crit hit damage. And by showing you all that, I still survived. So if that doesn't tell you how insanely broken this is, I'm not sure what is going to be. We're going to her stats. We can go into her defense. You can see I've got 63k armor regeneration. I've got incoming re repairs at 78%. And the game doesn't want me to be in my menu, but I am still alive. So absolutely insane. So have a go chat. Have some fun with it. I am pretty sure this will disappear really quickly. There is something wrong with the two talents in combination along with changing the instance in the game something seems to mess it all up and something seems to go wrong uh sadly it does work in the dz apparently the dz is plagued with it at the moment we went into the dz and i couldn't get it to work but again change your instance and i guess it will work uh as for conflict i have no idea that might work that might not work i have not been that interested to test it but uh, that is going to be it for the video. If you've put any combinations together of this and got it working, please hit me up in the comments down below. Come on over to Twitch and say hi. If I'm not streaming, hit follow. If I am streaming, hit follow anyway, because I could be live right now. Don't forget to subscribe here on YouTube and hit that thumbs up. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye, agents.